Hello everybody, it's Melissa from Hexnail Jewelry. Today we will be doing a mixed mani for Halloween to give you a little bit of everything. To get this look, you're going to need your favorite base and top coat, some textured black polish, some black polish, white polish, a lime green polish, some chevron nail vinyls from Hex Nail Jewelry, a nail art brush and dotting tool, some drippy nail vinyl, cuticle nippers, some black crushed velvet, tweezers and nail glue, and finally a nail charm. Alright, let's do this. First off, we're going to apply our base coat, then apply our textured polish to our pinky. And using regular black polish, we will apply it to our ring and pointer finger. As we wait for these nails to dry, we can start working on our middle finger and apply our chevron strip. Once it's placed where you would like it, you can go ahead and paint with white polish. Now remove your nail vinyl and apply a top coat to your ring finger. You'll see later on why. While we wait, we can go ahead and work on our ghost. Using black polish and a dotting tool, I made the eyes and mouth. You can now apply the drip tip onto your pointer finger and press down on the sides. Make sure you get those corners. To clean off the nail vinyl, I personally like to use the cuticle nippers. I just think it makes it a lot easier and precise to get that smooth finish. We will now go back to our ring finger and apply lime green nail polish with a thin nail art brush. Using a thicker brush, we're gonna go ahead and apply acetone on top of our lime green polish. This will give us a type of smoky look. I actually learned how to do this through a tutorial by Sarah of Chalkboard Nails. Super awesome, I recommend you checking it out. I will provide a link below. Using a thin nail art brush and some white polish, we will now write boo on top of our smoky effect. Don't worry about trying to make this look perfect since we are doing a type of smoky look, so even if it does smear, it'll actually go well with it. We will now go back to our pinky, apply nail glue and our cross on top. Now onto our thumb. We're gonna go ahead and paint it black, and while it's still wet, go ahead and apply that crushed black velvet on top. You can now go ahead and pat down the velvet, make sure all of it stays. And to clean it off, you can just blow or use acetone. Using nail glue and tweezers, we can go ahead and apply our little stud now. Using some top coat, we can now go ahead and seal our design. And you're all done. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Please like and subscribe if you did. We will be coming out with more videos shortly. So hang in there. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.